Hello and welcome to Daily Red Video. Today we will see how to uh, move a uh, Windows 7 uh, Parallels Virtual Machine copy from one Mac to another. So what I have done is um, I have first copied the Parallels Virtual Machine copy that .pvm extension file uh, from my MacBook Pro to uh, iMac uh, via pen drive. So I tried to do it add drop but because of its size uh, 16 gigabytes it's not possible to move uh, that huge file size uh, through the add drop. So I tried to do it with a pen drive. Uh, this pen drive actually formatted to XFAT uh, via disk utility on your Mac computer, uh, on uh, MacBook Pro. And uh, I then copied the virtual machine file uh, to the pen drive then. Um, now it's moved to here. So either you can uh, directly install it from the pen drive on iMac or you can just drag and drop it to some folder, uh, which way you're convenient, you know, which way, uh, the which way whichever the way you are convenient with all right so here you can see the uh, pvm file the virtual machine file and this is the parallels desktop control center uh, so this uh, is an ultimate utility uh, that will help you to install windows linux google chrome os and android inside mac operating system so this is a premium application and you will feel it uh, you know premium in every time you use and every way you navigate within this application so this is the windows 10 technical preview uh, version which i have tried to install uh, yesterday and successfully installed it um, so you can check out the video of how to install windows 10 technical preview uh, in the description of this video all right let's see how to add a new virtual machine so here i'm uh, you don't have to go to the migrating process because this process uh, is meant for migrating the bootcamp installation of a windows pc which you have already installed by partitioning your mac uh, hard drive so here uh, the process is i'm moving a virtual machine copy which i already installed on um, parallels uh, software which i have used in uh, macbook pro so i have i thought to move the parallels to uh, imac so i deleted the tab and uh, took this copy uh, backup uh, in a pen drive and i'm moving the so operating system installed alone so you can do this you know for any number of installation any number of OS installation uh, it'll work perfectly as you can see uh, they have given a quick download option for all the uh, top and popular operating operating system including the android here so all right so it's it's you know for adding uh, the uh, windows 7 uh, here i have to select add uh, existing virtual machine as you can see the parallels you know uh, shows the folder uh, so i can simply drag and drop this windows 7.vpm uh, to this uh, particular folder and make the installation process a lot easier all right here i have uh, successfully copied the windows 7 virtual machine file from uh, pen drive to uh, the local hard disk drive uh, which is the location of parallels folder as you can see the windows 7 dot uh, pvm uh, file is located in parallels folder so click on that and uh, click open and it will begin to register the windows 7 so if you want a separate mac address then you can uh, click on copied um, but here i'm going to click uh, mode because uh, i just want to uh, show it uh, you know just for demo purpose so i'm clicking on moved as you can see it's quickly uh, set up and um, completed with the uh, settings on the control center you can see the windows 7 uh, click to resume button so i can continue from where i have left off on another macbook pro so uh, this will work just you know without any problem and i can change the network uh, settings uh, the ram capacity the hard disk capacity and everything uh, thanks for watching have a wonderful day